Welcome to this installation tutorial of Shadow Multicast. Uh, first thing you want to do is download your file and extract it from the zip file. Uh, then once you've got your exe file, double click on it. This will start the installation process. And just click on yes if you're prompted. And this is the uh, intro screen. Um, click next. If you agree with the uh, license, click I accept the agreement, then click next. And now just click install to install the files. Okay, we click finish. Okay, all the files are now set up um, in their proper directories. Uh, what we need to do now is load in the menu bar. Um, to do that, open up AutoCAD and type menu load, all one word, hit space or enter. Now click browse and we'll scroll to C drive, program files, shadow multicast. And as you can see here, I have quite a few different files to choose from. That's because I'm installing the, uh, the capital, all capital cities of shadow multicast. You can select any one of those. Um, we'll select Melbourne. Um, now you'll notice the file extension here is either CUIX or you might be defaulting to MNU. It doesn't matter. Um, they both do the same thing. So whichever file type you see in there, just uh, click that one. Okay, so click open and then click load. And it's now loaded. But up the top here, as you can see, we can't see our menu. If you have the ribbon set up, um, as I do here, what you can do is click left click on the uh, the down arrow and click on show menu bar and as you can see now we have SMC Melbourne, Shadow Multicast Melbourne menu appearing. Um, another way to do that if you want to get rid of the ribbon is to click the arrow next to the one that we just clicked. Click left, left click and select AutoCAD Classic and that'll, that'll do the same thing, that'll bring up uh, the menu for us. So once we've got the menu there left click the menu, click on setup and down here in the command prompt you should be able to see shadow multicast loaded so that's set up all our directories and we're ready to go